Hi guys, this video is like the most random video I have probably ever put together. Um, it's basically combining several things that happened on my last kind of week of teaching. Um, and that is my last ever lecture that I went to, um, just for a vision one. But I also had a meeting um, about exceptional circumstances and things like that. So if you want to hear what it's like to be chronically ill and therefore have to use systems like exceptional circumstances because you have things out of your control. Um, and also I was part of, I went to my universe, university varsity for a day. Um, so if you want to see what that's kind of like, uh, there's not much footage from that day because I was with my friend, um, but there's a lot there. So <laughs> I've kind of shoved it in there because I've vlogged, I might as well give you all the footage. And then that's kind of the backlog of videos taken care of. So if there's anything you kind of want to see um, on this channel, like anything chronic illness related, university related, um, I'm planning on doing a room tour so you actually get to see what this is like because it's an accessible room. Um, let me know and I will make sure to do it because I've got a lot more free time now because university is pretty much over with. Um, I've got one exam in like three weeks but it's an open book so I'm just making master notes for the next like two weeks. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I hope you enjoy the video. Bye guys. Good morning. Today it's like a semi-special day. I am um, heading to campus for my last ever lecture. Of course it would have to be at 9am. So I woke up at 10 to... around 10 to 7. Um, I'm tired. <laughs> um, I've now got myself a cup of tea and a pound of chocolate. So yeah, this is my last ever lecture. Which is kind of weird to say. But... It's my last ever lecture, but it's a revision lecture, so it's technically not my last like learning lecture. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go in my little chair, um, and then afterwards I have a dissertation to write. So I'm going to meet up with someone for lunch, and then me and him are going to go and work in the library together <laughs> and be each other's motivation um, to get some shit done. <laughs> so yeah, that's what I'm planning on doing today. At least I've got all my f clothes and stuff laid out, so it's not going to be like a mad rush. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get going. I'm ready, my phone has been switched to wheelchair mode, um, so I'm at Apple Watch, which is new, will count my pushes. So without further ado, uh, let's get rolling. Empty campus is a fun campus, because it means I can just roll on the spine. Full belt and not have to avoid people. <laughs> Campus is like dead. <laughs> I forget what it's like on final term. In final term, term. Because we didn't have the final term in second year. So, so yeah. It's a bit of a path trying to pay for my bus ticket though, because I don't have a bus pass anymore because it expired and I don't qualify in my home county for a free bus pass so i do in lancaster though makes no sense um so yeah i have to like because i use my apple watch so that i don't have to like faff around with my bag and stuff but i still have to like reverse and then the bus driver has to go back in it's just a bit of a bath but anyway i have a return now so that's fine we just wait i suppose until my lecture starts this is when they've moved it or something and i'm just like great um but yeah, I might go to the or something because it's literally just me here, which is weird. Hello everyone, I'm in the kind of crappy management school and um, disabled toilet. And by kind of crappy, you can't actually get next to it with a wheelchair. Um, not very well either. Um, my, I just had a meeting with my, she is my 
module administrator. Not my module, my course administrator, um, Alison. She's lovely. Um, to basically just go over where I'm at with the new diagnosis, is where I'm at with um, uni work, where I'm at, like kind of how this year's gone. And I was going to talk about the difference between this year and last year, uh, and year two, and you can literally see it in my grades. I just scraped a 2 1 in first year, in second year, and then final year, I'm like a solid first. So, um, you know, as long as I can keep that solid first, there's a potential that my grade, even though I'm not entirely borderline at the moment, but if I can keep my grade at a 2 1, uh, solid first, there's a chance that um, if I apply for what the the uni term PCs, which is optional circumstances, if I apply for that, I basically say, look, I apply for ECs in year two, you can see this, it's on record, um, this is the difference in teaching between this year and last year, um, this, well, year two and year four, um, these are the things that have been going on in year four too, um, you know, is there a pen, basically, um, the uni will consider that and potentially might upgrade my grade, providing I am somewhat borderline, which is basically the aggregate score, I think around 17, and I'm on 16.6 right now. So I need to try and get my score like a little bit higher, um, but potentially that will be what happens. Like if you're borderline, there's like rules, um, but for me, like the rules kind of will go out the window a little bit, and there's a little bit more flexibility providing for the ECs. Um, my lecture went really well, although the room was boiling. It was so warm. Um, so I just like, finished that and that's it. She's done. Um, yeah, work for the rest of the afternoon once I've had food. Um, right, so bye. So it's the same um, week. <laughs> the reason I have like red eyeshadow and red lipstick right now is this weekend is bank holiday for a start, but it's also our university varsity against York, where they do red and roses. <laughs> um, yeah, it's called roses. It reenacts the war of the roses um, that happened between Yorkshire and Lancashire. Obviously, um, we support Lancashire, so roses are red, heads are red. Um, so yeah, right now I'm just <laughs> packing some snacks and stuff because my friend is competing in the <laughs> swimming. <laughs> so I'm gonna go meet him and watch him and then we can have some snacks afterwards. And then I think we might be watching the water polo. I've got to see because I've done no work today and I need to do work. <laughs> um, dissertation deadlines, so. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the video if you did give it a like make sure you subscribe um so you don't miss out and i will see you in my next video which will hopefully be up in a week see you bye guys